come in. <laughs> thank you, thank you. They are just so sweet at this restore. So here's a shot around the store and you guys know the drill by now. We're gonna get into all the areas and I gotta tell you, they had tons of pictures here today. They are absolutely beautiful and the prices were phenomenal. I think this one was $6.50 and these were all larger prints. Look at this one, $6.50. And you know, like I've said before, if you don't like the picture, but you like the frame or you like the mat, think about that. And look at this lamp, $35. So that felt like marble there on the base. And look at the tassels. Oh, it's so fancy. <laughs> so, so fancy. Oh, and look at that base. Isn't that beautiful? And that was a heavy lamp. And definitely check your restore for mirrors. Look at this mirror. They had several here today. I thought that was beautiful. $12.50 for that large mirror. And here's another one of those prints, $8.50. It really felt like an art gallery in here today. I'm telling you, it was beautiful. And like I've said before, check your restore for pillows. That felt like a velvet. I hope you can see that beautiful green color. Those were $5 a piece. And look at this. So it was $55. They've marked it to $44. I love this wingback chair. And they had another one. We had seen it last time. They didn't have it priced yet, but they had it priced today. I was surprised they still had it. So that's coming up. And here's some larger pillows. These are $10 a piece, and I love that they had four of them. Okay, look at this chair. So it's an accent chair, $14. I loved it. You know, those touch-up markers, it's going to be good as new. But I got to tell you, I love the seat. It felt like a really heavy linen material. And there's another accent chair that's even prettier than this coming up. Okay, look at these chairs. I love this type of chair. It just kind of gives me a country vibe. These were $11 a piece, and I thought they were in fantastic condition. Oh, and I just love that seat bottom. I'm not sure what that's called, uh, ruching, rushing, caning, <laughs> I don't know, but I love it. And look at these candle sconces. Like I've said before, check your restore for home decor. I mean, these were like $3.50, $3.50. Okay, I know I showed this table last week, but I wanted to give it another moment, $85. I'm shocked they still have this accent table. Oh, it is so pretty with the mirrored top and just the beautiful design on the side. And look at this green sofa. So I think that was leather. It's $75. I love just the smaller size of it. And here's a shot through their dining room tables and chairs. You know, definitely check your restore for items like that. Okay, here's that chair. So $55. They didn't have it priced the last time we were here, but I love it. To me, it gives me a Ralph Lauren vibe. And this is just another reason we need to shop our restore several days a week. This desk was sold and it is absolutely beautiful. Oh, so pretty. And here's another one of those mirrors, $6.50. I love this mirror. I love the size of it. It's not too big. Here's a six drawer wooden sofa table for $145. Oh, I love that. I love the stain on the wood. And you know I have to open a drawer. I love those pulls. They had several beds here today. This is the first one I came across, so $125, and it's a canopy bed. I love that metal frame. And here's just a little close-up of the headboard. I really thought that was interesting. Okay, one of my viewers said they were looking for a gold picture frame with no glass in it. Here it is, it's $3.50. I hope, whoever you are, that you're close enough to come by and pick this up. $3.50. Oh, and this frame caught my eye. I love that salmon color. 
I thought this was probably one of the best deals in the ReStore today. So $65, look at this desk. So it's got space for a computer tower. Look at all the shelving. I love the glass front. Oh, that is so pretty. $65, look at that bevel glass. And it looks like it must have a light inside. Oh, that's pretty. Look at this plaid armchair for $60. I thought that was a fantastic deal. I love all those colors. Like I've said before, check your ReStore for baskets. These were beautiful. The larger one was $6.50. I think the smaller one was maybe $5, $5.50. Aren't those unique? Okay, here's the other accent chair I came across, $14. You know I love that dark wood. I love the cream. I love the nail head trim. Isn't that dreamy? Oh, I love that chair. And here's some more of their artwork. These were $12 a piece. I wanted to showcase these so these are actually spice containers I thought they were so cute so you know if you've got room to display them why not and look at this I thought it was beautiful I would use this as maybe a sugar jar or maybe serving jam three dollars and I thought these were beautiful I love to just look at their glassware at the restore a dollar fifty a piece for those And here's a shot kind of back through their bedroom section. They had tons of chests and dressers here. Look at this dresser. So it's 80 bucks. They'd marked it down from $100. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, I love that design on the front. Can you believe it? I found a Pier 1 headboard, $60. I love that basket weave design on the back. Look at this black metal headboard, footboard, no rails, $48. Fabulous deal. And it's got like the large four posters on the bed. And I thought this was really cute. So it's a wine craft made in Italy, $250. And I like these flowers around this little tea light for $1.50. Okay, look at this picture for $6.50. I love the subject in it. So it looks like this lady's out walking her little lamb and this man's hunting with his dog. And he's, oh, it's nice to meet you. <laughs> I hope they ended up happily ever after. And definitely check your ReStore for cups or mugs. They're typically, you know, 25 cents, 50 cents, maybe a dollar. Oh, and look at these, 50 cents. And 50 cents and check your restore for cookbooks you know the drill they're from 75 cents up to a dollar 25 and it's just fun to go back here and see what they've got look at this good housekeeping instant pot cookbook who out there uses their instant pot I love mine oh and what's this one say perfect pies sign me up <laughs> sign me up Oh, and Field and Family. I think that's specifically a North Carolina magazine. And I've tried some Better Homes and Gardens uh, recipes, and they are always fabulous. And this looked interesting. So it's the Light Touch Cookbook. And this actually won, I think, or, or was nominated for a Julia Child Award. So you know that's going to be a good cookbook. Oh, and here's a Southern Living Easy Weeknight Favorites. And here's another one of those pictures. I'm telling you, it just went on and on through this store today. So this was $12.50, and this is huge. This is probably, I don't know, four feet tall. Oh, so cute. 
and I was really drawn just to these glass serving pieces, $1.50. And you know, people like to do their charcuterie boards. I think this would be perfect, just a different take on it. And those were $3 a piece and they had two of those. And I think this was more like of a cake server. I didn't get the price on that, but you know, it's only gonna be a few bucks. And look at this, $3.50. So this is a little ice bucket. And you know I love to go through their assorted dishes, so they go anywhere from 25 cents for a cup or mug up to $2 for a serving dish. Look what I found, oh my goodness. They have these cute plates back here. So I love the red and white, I love the little hen and her babies, her chicks, from Country Living. So those are gonna be a dollar a plate. And look, they had a huge stack. I mean, they probably had eight or 10 plates there. And here's just some more of their artwork. These I think were $12.50 or $14.50 a piece. And these were huge, huge pictures. Oh, I love that with the flowers. Oh, and I'm from the country. So with the barn scene, that kind of takes me back. And I gotta tell you, I think this one was my favorite with the fall colors. And look at this old chest. So my restore gets vintage furniture in from time to time. This was a little over $100. Oh, I loved it. And it's an older piece. I know it probably needs some work. With these old pieces, I don't think I would do any touch up. I think I would just enjoy the wear of it. And this piece looked older too. It's $175. It's a China Hutch. Oh, I loved it. I loved everything about that. I love the dark wood. I love all the glass. I love the arch top on the windows. That's a pretty piece of furniture. And look at this metal and wicker stool for $42. I just thought that was so cute. And you know I've got to show you that gold sofa behind it. So $185. And that was really soft brocade material. Oh, I love those pillows on it too. Oh, love those colors. Look at these older rockers. They were $150 a piece, but you know, I was really surprised the caning on the seats were in really good condition. And this is just another reason we need to shop our restore. I think this thing's called a table saw. Um, they had already sold it, so you know, they've got something for everyone at the restore. And look at this brand new, no one's ever used it. It's still got the plastic on it. It's a leg workout bench. And they were just setting these items out. So they've got several of the large flat screen TVs and they test them to make sure they work. And look at these chairs. You got all four of these chairs for $44. Okay, I wanna show you this desk. So it's $150, it looks like an armoire. It's definitely a space saver. I asked them to show me kind of how it works. So here we go. So I kind of snooped around, I opened it up. It kind of shows a little diagram of how to do the desk part. But look at this, look how roomy this is when you open it up. So it's got, you know, it's all built for your electronics. And look at this desk. Isn't that fantastic? Look at that, all the space in the world. And it's got these little, I guess it's like a cork board that you could put messages on. Isn't that fabulous? And they had several corner cabinets here today. This smaller one was $35 and it's beautiful. I'm telling you, it's so pretty, but there's one coming up. Oh, I can't wait for you to see it. You're gonna love it. Okay, so here it is. It's two of these corner cabinets for $200 and they were made in Great Britain. 
look at these cabinets. I'm not sure what kind of wood that is. To me, it kind of looks like wormy chestnut. I'm not sure. These are huge. They're beautiful. Oh my goodness. If I had room for these, I think they'd be at my house. <laughs> they definitely need to be at my house. Look how pretty. Just very unique. Oh, I love that molding on the top. And you know, like I said, the ReStore has something for everyone. Here is like a truck bed toolbox for $45. And here's another shot around the store. And like I told you before, when you shop at your ReStore, you're going to help someone else with home ownership or home repairs. Okay, who out there remembers a little electric Smith Corona typewriter? <laughs> oh, I do. You really thought you were something when you were in typing class and you actually got to use the electric typewriter. <laughs> And here's some more of their pictures. I really love this one with the flowers, $8.50. And here's some more of the beds they had today. I think some of those beds were $25. Oh, and there's that sleigh bed. I think someone had already bought that. Oh, and there's that waterfall bed. And I think that smaller bed in the front was like $20, $25. And they've got some more coming up. Oh, and look at this lamp. You know I love those swirly wrought iron lamps. $14. And look at this bed. So it's a metal canopy bed, $150. And I think it's a twin size bed. I loved it. I thought it was beautiful. And to the left of the screen, that's actually part of the top of the bed where you put the canopy. And look at the four posters. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, I just thought it was gorgeous. And they kind of had it set up in miniature, like it would be longer uh, than they've got it set up there. But look, oh, look at those little flower swags. Isn't that beautiful? You know someone's going to love that. And they've got their Valentine's themed items out. This is a little vase, 50 cents. Can you believe it? 50 cents for that. I wanted to showcase this bed. I know it's been sold, but I absolutely love the color of it. I just love the design of it. That's a pretty bed. And here are some of their Valentine's themed mugs, 50 cents a piece. Okay, this is the last bed I'm gonna show. I absolutely love that rusted finish on it. So it's $75. In my mind, that bed's going to be in someone's bedroom with an old country quilt on it and different mismatched pillows. Oh, I love, love that bed. I wouldn't do a thing to that. And now we're getting into their silent auction area. This restore has items up front that they label as part of their auction. And you go through, you guys know the drill, you find something you like, you put your name and your contact information in their book. If you're the winning bid at the end of the auction, they'll contact you and you get to come in and buy the item. And like I've said a million times before, it's just so much fun to come in here and kind of see what they've got up for auction. I love those little glass, uh, I guess they're blown glass pieces. And look at that tiny little Singer sewing machine. Oh, and I gotta tell you, so these are, I guess, handmade mailboxes. And I tried to open one, I couldn't get it open. <laughs> I didn't show that, but I was a little embarrassed. Oh, and look, there's another mailbox with a nautical theme. And here's some more of the auction items. I think these were like Saturday Evening Post glasses. Oh, and there's some Native American items. It's just fun. You never know what's going to pop up in these auctions. I oh, want some old cookbooks. And up front, they have kind of like larger lots of items that they get in. And these are drawer pulls, brand new. And like I've said before, you know, if you find maybe uh, a chest of drawers in the back and you don't like the pulls, look around your restore and see if they've got items like this around. Typically, I can find knobs and pulls at about every restore I go to. And, you know, 
you're gonna you're gonna pay a dollar, a dollar fifty. Oh, that's pretty. I love that one. Oh, that's pretty too. A dollar. So I hope everyone's had fun shopping with me today. Please just like and subscribe, spread the word so our channel can keep growing. So I just wanted to showcase the sign I found. It says dream, create your dream and live it. And I want to give you guys the courage to do that because I don't know what got into me, but I got the courage to create this YouTube channel and I'm certainly living my dream and you guys are helping me along with it. So I want to thank every one of you out there. I appreciate you so much and I hope everyone has a wonderful day. So until next time, come go with me today. Bye.